Naz is tears. Yeah, those are the tears of the clown. Naz is tears. The second tear. Hold on, let me get my pen. Naz is tears. Dallas. Yeah. Buffalo. Tennessee. Naz is tears. Third tier. Okay, here we go. Hold on, let me get my pen. Naz is tears. 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 All right, I said we had no football scheduled. I lied. I forgot. Naz is tears. It's upon us. They're presented by the Bernardi Automotive Group. When it comes to auto dealers, the Bernardi Automotive Group always finishes top tier. They sell and service Acura, Audi, Honda, Nissan, Toyota, and Volvo. Bernardi for now, Bernardi for life. Visit them now at BernardiAutoGroup.com. Maz, what do we have this week? Okay, just quickly, uh, Murray, you know Adam, uh, Adam 12 on 92.9? Yeah. Yeah, he mentioned to his compliment to you that he started playing this song again because of this bit. Nice. Oh, that's great. <laughs> okay. So you're you are you're actually controlling the music on another station, Murray. There uh, you go. Ozzy getting some spins, courtesy of Felger and Mass. So we went with the uh we went with traditional tiers this week, uh, uh NFL power rankings, because frankly, the Patriots deserve it. So that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna stick with the tiers. And when we get to tier five, we've broken them down in order. Sub tiers. Tiers within the tiers. Okay. So you wanna hang around for tier five, but as always, we will start with tier one. And Tier 1 in the NFL, four teams in Tier 1. Four teams right now. Philadelphia Eagles, you asked me last week, Mike, who's the best team in the league? I think Philly's the best team in the league right now. However, Baltimore Ravens a close second. They have been blowing doors the last couple of weeks. Kansas City's defense, that's right, Kansas City's defense is for real. And Cincinnati now 5-3, and three. they've won four in a row. Joe Burrow's been the best player in the universe. In the last couple of weeks, Cincinnati's turned a corner. I would say watch out for this week's game, though. Something scary about that for me. But those are your four best teams in the league right now at this moment. Murray, your thoughts? I feel like you could maybe squeeze one more team up into Tier 1. Who? The Jacksonville Jaguars. Hmm, good choice, Murray. They were off this past week. I don't think I've quite had them up on Tier 1 yet, but that brings us to Tier 2. Well, let's see. Yeah, maybe they're sniffing it. Yeah, why dink around? Let's go right to Tier 2. Again, now these are in no particular order until we get to Tier 5. San Francisco, Detroit, Miami, Mm. Cleveland, Dallas, Jacksonville, Buffalo. Mm. I think all these teams are pretty good. Cleveland? Cleveland. Now, I admit. Tier 2? Cleveland could be at the top of Tier 3. What? We got some bloat in Tier 2 here. But uh, the reason they're in Tier 2, their defense, legit. It is. A, it might be the best defense in the NFL. Tier two. Although, ball, yes, tier two for the Cleveland Browns. Uh, yep. Pop, pop that up. No, no, you can bitch. Go ahead, bitch. It's fine. I know it's coming. Murray, go ahead. I mean, Miami should clearly be in tier three, and same with Buffalo. I think Buffalo looks like, you know, they've got real problems. Miami can't beat any team that's actually done anything this year. They can only beat up the dregs of the league. They do not belong in tier two. Can they beat some of the teams in tier two? Pop it up again. I forget San what San Francisco, on. Detroit. Cleveland, Dallas, Jacksonville, Buffalo. Well, Miami can't because anytime they play anyone good, they lose. Okay, but they've only, I think they've only lost to teams in tier one. Philadelphia, Kansas City, who's the other one against? I can't remember, but you get the idea. Mm. Okay, uh, tier three, you can bitch about them. It's fine. I really don't care, but I'm moving on. (laughs) Okay. Tier three, (laughs) Pittsburgh, Seattle, New Orleans, Minnesota, Houston, the Chargers, the Jets, uh, the Colts, uh, the Falcons. Uh, I know is the Falcons were a little bit of a stretch. They're four and five now. There's a lot of stretches. Yeah, there's in there. some stretching. So again, there's a lot of bad teams in this league this year. A lot of bad teams. These to me qualify as relatively mediocre. Pittsburgh and Seattle right now are in the playoffs, I believe. I think they're both yeah, in. That, no, 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 no. Those yeah, are fine. Yep. I don't have an issue with that. The Saints, the Jets, did you? Jets? It's the Jets. Jets, Jets. are a five hundred team. That quarterback cannot play. 500 team. If you think he can't play, wait till we get to tier four. Yeah, let's get to tier four. <laughs> tier four, Washington, the Raiders, the Buccaneers, Green Bay, Tennessee, Denver, and the Rams. You see how many crap teams there are in the league? Oh, yeah. No, that's tier bad. four. Yeah. That's tier four. So, again, that's seven. Seven teams. All those teams have losing records. Frankly, I think they all suck. They have suck quarterbacks. There isn't a team on that list that has a reliable, legit, healthy quarterback. They all suck. So, like, this to me, it's a it's a bad middle and lower class in the NFL this year. It's a top-heavy league. 
And those teams in the middle, the top of Tier 3 are okay. I mean, in theory, I guess we could divide Tier 3 into two tiers. We do 3A and 3B. Maybe we'll entertain that going forward. Because, you know, again, you can't have too many tiers. You can't have tiers. too much bloat. Yeah. Right. You can't have too many tiers. So we may have to divide that one going forward. I'm into that. But Tier 5, we should really make it Tier 6. You know they skip the 13th floor in hotels? <laughs> yeah, yeah. We should skip Tier 5 because these teams really suck. I mean, they really belong in Tier 6. In order, Chicago, New England, Arizona, Carolina, the Giants. In order. In order. And I I toyed with the idea of putting the Patriots at the top of this tier, but honestly, the Bears with that quarterback from Division II, Bajant, is that how you pronounce it? Yeah. Yeah. They're not that bad. They're okay. He's okay. I think he's better than Mac Jones. He's got more tools than Mac Jones does. The bottom three teams in that tier, though, are real garbage. I mean, they are real. The Giants are freaking maybe one of the worst teams I've ever seen. So I'm not. I don't have the Patriots down quite in the bottom three yet. Are they working their way there though? Yep, yep. You have another game. If the Gi- Giants play well one week, and the Patriots go the other way, <laughs> <laughs> last week, uh, next week, we might have to create a tier seven. <laughs> <laughs> 